Welcome back, it's good to see you. Now if you saw the last video on the tiny little circuit here that uses no coils, this is a little wireless energy thing, I did put a little lead coming out from the circuit to try single wire transmission experiments. And that got me wondering about a bigger system and can we send, you know, the power a long way. So I've got one of these BACs, the big ass coil, and I managed to find out that this transistor, the first one, does still work. All three were in parallel and with the CMEs from the Sun, the Sunspots, um, I thought I'd killed all three. But that one does still work. The battery pack has got three and a half volts on it. Very, very old NIMHs from about 1990. But uh, they do still take a charge to about three and a half volts. And if I switch on here, you can see that light comes on. And of course it's it's wireless. So one wire transmission is the idea. And I've got this clip lead here connected. If I pick that up, you can see the light is on over the one wire. And my idea is to take it outside to run this 30 gauge wire as far as I can, hundreds of feet say, and hopefully we get transmission over that distance. So let's take it outside and have a look what happens. I've brought the setup out to the back of the house. There's a back wall of the porch, and it's over here. Because I want to try single wire transmission all the way through to there. Well, all the way to, let me see, no point me saying there. As far as you can see, basically, you see this pine tree that's about 100 feet away. There's another one just to its right. And I think I'm going to go even further than that away with a single wire to another tree. I've started to roll the wire out. And you can see from my walking how far we're going. And I got about halfway and I thought I'll grab the camera for this. And all the way down here, past this first pine tree. Carrying on, and this should give a good idea of these distances. And we're just over halfway, I guess. There's the reel on the floor, and we're going beyond those tyres that were left by the previous owner. In fact, I think I'll take it to the tree. There's a tree over there more in line with where we've come from. Oh, and there comes the cat. Right, let's carry on. Okay, and here we are at that tree. So you can see, I'll turn it back around, you can see where the house is. This is going to be fun to find out. Alright, we're back up at the circuit. I've connected up the batteries. We can see the system is working. Now we'll go down to the end and see whether we're getting the one wire transmission. All that way. Right, I've got the wire in my hand, but you can see that the light isn't on. Here is the copper in the ground. If I put the negative to it, would you look at that? The light is on all that distance, and we're getting the single wire transmission. Now, I forgot to bring a clip with me, but I'll try and arrange this such that I'm not touching it whatsoever. Right, I've managed to clip it on there, and as you can see, that light is on. That is quite wonderful for the distance. There we go, single wire transmission. I've just checked on Google Earth using the measurement tool. These old batteries from about 1990 with three and a half volts on and this system have just done a distance of 350 feet or over 105 meters. That is incredible. This is a mains LED nightlight. 
I'll plug it in so you can see it working. There we go, plugged into the wall there, the socket, and you can see how it works like that. So we'll see if that works on the system outside. So I've got one prong in my hand, and I'll touch the other to one of the contacts on the coil, and you might be able to see it does in fact light. And if I come right down here, down the other end, 350 feet away, and maybe you can see the light is glowing in there. And now that it's going towards night time, there it is, lit up next to the tree. Well, that was a great success. If you like this sort of thing and want to see continued experiments, please do consider leaving a like and maybe subscribing. Thank you very much for watching.